Hello, today I'm going to show you how to integrate Abbey Flexi Capture with Navision 2016. Sometimes it's called Navision and sometimes we call it Nav. Um, for cases of this demo, we're going to call it Navision. Now what you see on front, in front of me is Abbey Flexi Capture. This is where we read details off the invoice. Then on my other screen where I'm going to sneak it over here so you can see it, you will see that I have Navision open and uh, we have currently no purchase invoices uh, in the system at this time. So what we're going to do is integrate Abbey Flexi Capture with Navision, where we'll transfer uh, these invoices and the data that we pull off of them into NAV, therefore making the process very, very simple and clean for us. So let's start off with Abbey Flexi Capture. I'll explain what you see on the screen. What we did is we captured three invoices, and we'll quickly look at them. First, uh, if I double click the first one, you'll see on the left is the information that we captured off of uh, the invoice itself. And on the right, you'll see an image of the invoice uh, for our reference. By clicking in the fields, you can see that we highlight over here in yellow uh, where we found that field. Um, and also we have rules and different things that we can apply here. Now, the purpose of today's demo is not to explain every piece of architecture uh, as far as Abbey Flexi Capture for invoices go. We do have other videos that show a, quite a bit of the in-depth behind the scenes work of this, but today we're going to focus on how the integration works with Navision. So let's keep highlighting here what we have. We have our totals, we have our purchase orders that we can reference, and then we also have our line items here that we capture beautifully uh, here at the bottom. So let's take a peek at these other two. And you'll see here, once again, we can determine the business unit, the vendor. We can also expand and extract these fields to learn inf more information about either uh, business unit or vendor. We have invoice numbers and dates, amounts, purchase orders, and then once again, the line item details for this one. And lastly, we have our final invoice where we capture everything beautifully as well. Once again, on the left is what we extracted off of the invoice, and on the right is a copy of the invoice for our reference. So what we're going to do now is export these into Navision. It's a very simple process, and we'll kind of watch the logs here, and you'll see that we, we have a process starting and process ended, meaning it started the export to Navision, and it's done. And we're going to do that with three separate times, and now it is completed. So now in being in, in Navision, we can hit our refresh button and you see we instantly have three new purchase invoices within the system. And we can double click these. And within these, of course, we have our vendor information here at the top, sometimes called a buy from uh, keyword. And then we have our line items here as well. And for the cases of the demo, we're referencing a GL account. Now this is completely customizable when you purchase our solution. Um, but once again, for the purposes of this demo, we just assign them all to one GL account. You can see we find uh, things like quantities, unit of measures, unit costs, and those kind of things as well. So it's very simple, the integration is. And you can see we have our other two purchase invoices that we integrated as well. I'll show these to you just really quick so you can kind of understand what happens. Once again, we have the vendor information at the top and then our line items down here at the bottom. Once again, this is completely customizable um, and we have full integration technology that we can use to make this specific to what your organization is running today. And we'll look at our last purchase invoice here. Once again, our vendor information populates and then we also have our GL account line items. So that is how simple the integration is. You see we were able to automatically capture invoice details within Abbey Flexi Capture, and then after we extract those details, we're able to export those directly into Navision, therefore making our accounts payable process fully automated and very, very easy to implement. So I hope you enjoyed this video and how easy it was to, to see how that process flows for your organization, and we'd love to be of service to you if you have any questions. Thank you so much.